Good morning, Santorini, and what's up, everyone? What's up, Santorini? Good morning, everyone, and welcome again to our new travel and a new day discovering Santorini. So, what are we waiting for? Let's go get started and let's go. Welcome to Paradise. We are here in Fira, the capital of Santorini. Hey there, my fellow touristas. Hey everyone, if you are new here, it's Bernardo and welcome to my channel. So, my fellow turistas, we are here again. We are about to begin a new video and a things to discover in Santorini. We are all very excited. We are all here to see what is new what is the things to do in Santorini. So just sit back, enjoy, and relax, and keep watching. And with our next video, we are going to discover the um, I think the second most uh, um, populated uh, area in Santorini, which is Ia, and it, it's one of the most, I mean, it's one of the most uh, um, tourist spots here in Santorini. We are, we are going uh, to see the magical sunset. I mean, it's one of a kind uh, sunset and then we're gonna show some nice clips here everything is beautiful and in this video we are going also to see 
another beautiful beach in Santorini so as you see we all just see and visited already the red beach and then if you don't see, um, if you miss that uh, video just go down there and see my previous video so what are you waiting for let's get started and enjoy Trivia guys, do you know why Santorini is all colored white and the blue roof? I mean, I know if you see a lot of postcards, imagine and photos around Santorini, are you thinking why is everybody, I mean, why it's colored white and why it's everybody colored blue? I mean, the fact is it's colored white because as you can see there's a lot of white houses white buildings and then in the roofs it's all colored blue it's because this represents the color of their flag if you see the flag of greece it's white and blue so that's the meaning of the colors everywhere so the white means purity and the blue one is the color of the sea and the sky. Siamo in Ia, il secondo centro abitato in Santorini. And another trivia is that do you know that in Santorini it has all um, almost 15,000 people? Imagine the 15,000 people and then the tourists is about 2 million people. Wow. So do you see that? I think we all know Santorini is one of the most visited island here in Greece. It's one of the best spot. It's one of the best tourist spot here. And it's because it's well known um destination especially in summer i mean i think it's especially all times in the month So guys, did you know that the entire Santorini is, uh, the entire island is uh, a volcanic rock and that is why we have 
um, beaches such as the Red Sea, the Black Sea and the White Sea. So let's talk about some stories around the Santorini. And uh, did you know guys that Santorini exists because of the Minion eruption? So yes, it was really, the place is really made with the volcanic eruption. So, and it was one um, of the largest volcanic eruption in the history of the earth. So Santorini and its surroundings are surrounding island. Um, were created actually after the volcanic eruption so as you can see there's a lot of cliffs there a lot of uh, um, um, rocks uh, volcanic rocks so that is why Santorini is made all about and uh, before um, it was called uh, not Santorini but it was called um, it was called Caliste, and meaning the most beautiful ones. So it's a uh, 7 p.m. here in Santorini and we are preparing to go out as today we are going to visit I mean today we are going to witness the spectacular sunset in Santorini so if you are in Santorini um, there's a lot of uh, uh, places uh, if you want to see the famous uh, spectacular sunset in Santorini. So today we are here in Ia and we're going to witness um, the sunset. As they say it's around uh, 8 o'clock, 8.15 to 8.30. That's just gonna be um, the time. We're going out first um, early because we all know there's a lot of tourists, there's a lot of people who are going to want to see the sunset. So it's nice if you're going to go out uh, early and we're going to um, find a nice places to sit back and enjoy watching the sunset. Here there's a lot of souvenirs that you can buy all over the shops in IA. So as you can see it's 8.15 in the evening and the sun is start going down and the sunset is about to start.
nella strada secondo sunset here in Ia. So if you wanna say something, your thoughts about it, what can you say about the sunset, just write down below. So you guys, are you excited to see and discover the black beach? I mean, for me, it's my first time to see a black beach, so I'm quite um, excited about it. I'm, I'm, um, I'm really, really thrilled, and I can't wait to see what the black sea around. It's in Perisa and it's uh, I think it's uh, less than an hour in Tira in the capital so it started
and that's it guys i hope you enjoyed the video i hope um, you put your likes and down there i hope you write um, what are your thoughts what are your comments on my video it's really i mean i will always read all of them and i try also to respond as much as possible because i'm i'm really enjoying reading it i'm in um, enjoy um, I mean I'm smiling every time I read all your comments and I really really appreciate so thank you thank you thank you so much I hope you come back again I hope you uh, watch also my I other videos there and, and that's it hasta la vista ciao